In this video, I will show you how to solve proportion question using soft function in Casual 5x 70ex. So it is given that y is directly proportional to 1 over square root x and y equal to 3 when x equals 36. So we want to find the value of y when x equals to 6, 8, 4 and the value of x when y equals to 9. So to find for the solution, let y equal to k times 1 over square root x and when y equal to 3, x equal to 36 and we need to find out the value of k. Okay, so begin alpha y alpha equal um, k the variable that we can use in this calculator we have a b c d x y m this seven variable that is in pink okay we don't have k so i use a to represent k here so i have the alpha a times i have the one over square root of alpha x and because uh, by default when I call the solve the calculator will solve for x but now I'm looking for the value of a instead of x so I have to put a comma shift comma and a behind to tell, tell the cal calculator that actually I want to solve for a instead of solve for x which is the default so I pre press shift and calculate with your call solve and y equals 3 x is equal to 36 and the, we want to solve for a value for a we initial guess we just put 2 then the calculator will tell you a is equal to 18 and the right hand side of the formula minus the left hand side of the formula is equal to 0 so a equal to 18 is the solution for this equation so k equal to 18 okay after that we want to solve the value of y of our y and shift solve when a is equal to 18 x is equal to 4 soft y we just guess any value so y is equal to 9 so we have 4 here then square root of 4 will give you 2 18 divided by 2 is 9 y equal to 9 so we solve for the second question when y equal to 9 we want to find the value of x so you have the alpha x here or you don't put the alpha x and shift solve the calculator by default will help you to find for the value of uh, the 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 x so y equal to 9 then a equal to 18 and then we want to solve we put any initial guess so we have x equal to 4 and the left hand side and right hand side of the cup formula minus will get 0 Okay.